Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to connect a USB pin drive to an Android TV box to retrieve your files, videos, photos, music and so on. Most Android boxes have two USB ports. One is black and the other one is blue, 3.0 and 2.0. The only difference between the two is the speed. If your USB pin drive does not work on one port, you just switch to the other one. Now I'm going to connect my box to my TV and I'm going to show you how to retrieve your files, videos, photos, music and so on. I am also going to show you how to convert and fix any corrupted files in your USB pin drive. So once the USB pin drive is connected to your TV box, look for file or files or file manager. It depends on your box model. Open files, you will see USB or the name of your USB pin drive. Just open that so I have the name of my USB pin drive right here, Kingston. Just tap once to open it. Once it's open, you will see all of the videos, pictures, and music you have saved in your USB pin drive. So I'm going to share three types of files. If you have problems with one of these files, it means that, that the format you are using for that file, video, picture, or music is not supported by your TV box. So I'm going to show you later how to fix these problems. So I'm going to open this file, for example, most televisions and TV boxes will support JPG format for pictures, MP4 format for videos, and MP3 for music. For example, you have this picture here. You have the name of the picture right here, and you have a dot JPG. Most televisions and TV boxes will support JPG. If one of your pictures is corrupted, you cannot open it. It means that the format you are using in your TV box is not supported. So I'm going to share another file. This time it's going to be a video. As I said, most televisions and TV boxes will support MP4 for videos. This is an example of a video. You have the name of the video, .mp4. Most television boxes and televisions will support the MP4 format. You should see this information here, .mp4. So I'm going to open this. So it's going to open without any problems because the format used in that video is supported by my TV box. So I'm going to show you other examples. I have many different formats for pictures, videos, and music. I have this picture right here, for example. It's a WEBP format. And I have another one here. It's a .png. PNG is supported by my TV box. And WEBP is also supported by my TV box. I can open these pictures without any problems because all these formats are supported by my tv box so i'm gonna show you an example that is not supported by my tv box this file for example is a video it does not open if i click on it it does not open it just gives me an error so i cannot open this file this video because the format is not supported by my tv box you have the name of the file, .mov. So, mp4 is supported, but mov is not supported. So, I have to convert this file to mp4 in order for me to read it. Otherwise, it's not going to work. That's why you cannot open some files in your USB pin drive. It's because of the format. I have other examples here. I have a piece of music here. 
if I click on it, it's going to open easily without any issues because the MP3 format is supported by my TV box. You have the name of the file .mp3. Most televisions and TV boxes will support MP3 for music, MP4 for videos, and JPG for pictures. All the files that you are using in your different devices like a phone, a DVD, Blu-ray, TV box, television, and so on, must be supported. If these formats are not supported by your device, you will not be able to open them. So now, I'm going to go on my computer and I'm going to show you how to convert your files from a different format to the right format in order to fix the problem. So I'm now on my computer and I'm going to show you how to fix any corrupted files, videos, pictures or music using a video editor or picture editor. So connect your USB pin drive to your computer. First, once it's connected, go to your computer or PC, find the USB pin drive in your computer and open it. You will see all of your files. Find the file that is corrupted, that's not working, that you cannot open in your TV or TV box. I'm going to start with pictures. Let's choose a picture. Let's go with this one. Select the picture. Right click using your computer mouse and tap edit. We'll go to open with image editor. So I'm going to go with this option edit here. Once you press edit you'll get your picture. I'm just going to reduce the size. This is my picture that's not opening on my TV box. So once you get the picture go to file here tap file save and give it a name let's say picture number picture one and don't forget the extension or the format it's very important put dot j p g as i said because most televisions and tv boxes will read j p g files so give it a name dot j p g what's important is the format dot j p g don't forget the dot save i'm gonna save the picture to my desktop it's right here this is my picture now you can open your picture without any issues so i'm gonna do another one let's go with this one just highlight the picture don't open it now right click using your computer mouse tap edit you will get the picture editor i'm using windows once the picture is open go to file tap file right here now tap save give it your name picture number two dot without space dot j p g choose the location where you want the picture saved so i'm gonna save it tap save for videos it's different open a web browser in your computer like google chrome and look for convert video to mp4 or look for mp4 video converter you will get hundreds of links so i'm gonna go with the first one you can of course try other links once you open the video converter you will see this option tap select file once you press select file this will prompt you to your computer you just find your USB pin drive this is my pin drive Kingston now open the video that's corrupted that's not opening in your TV or TV box 
I'm going to open this file. I'm going to choose any video just to show you an example. Once you have selected the video, you just tap open. As you can see here, choose the format. We were talking about MP4. So you will see other formats. These formats may not be supported by your television or TV box. So we're going to go with the standard one, which is MP4. Choose MP4. Now tap convert. It's going to take a few minutes. It depends on the size of the file. Your video may not be converted if it's too large. You just wait. OK, perfect. So once the video is converted, you will see this option here. Download. You just tap that. I'm going to give it a name. Let's say, for example, video number 1001. You don't have to add the format like I've done for pictures. You just give it a name. Find the location where you want to save the video and tap Save. For the music, it's going to be the same thing. Instead of MP4, you put mp3 so you just open a browser in your computer convert music to mp3 or mp3 converter let's go with the first one so once you open the link you will see select file you go to the USB. Now look for the piece of music you want to convert to MP3. So I'm gonna go with this one for example. This song. Once you press convert to you will see these formats. If your song is one of these formats it might not work. You may not be able to open it in your TV box or on your TV. Always use this one, MP3. And tap convert. It's going to take a few minutes. You can either press here download or go to the three dots right here and tap download. Once you press that, you will get this prompt. You just give it a name, audio or song, whatever. Audio number one you just tap save so i'm going to choose the location to save the file save so that's it guys that's what i wanted to share with you today don't forget to subscribe if it's the first time you're watching my videos see you on the next one